Okay, so welcome back to Razenko's excellent adventure. Remains to be seen whether it ends up actually being a bogus journey or not, but, you know, it could go either way. Um, I realised this game autosaves and not very regularly, so I had to actually catch up to where I was last time. Um, I'll have to be a bit more careful about where I wrap up in future. But uh, there we go. Uh, I found a nugget of wisdom. Every brain acquires nuggets of wisdom along the way. Finding one will impart enough concentrated wisdom to gain a rank. Oh, that's cool. So I guess... Uh, I guess we don't need to find Psy thingies. Otherwise, I don't know. You'll probably get kicked out of the psychonauts for trying. Psy orbs, Psy uh, Psy eyeballs, those things. I really wish they'd stop looping their dialogue. It's very distracting. I'm trying to talk over it, but I've got these like constant voices in my head, which I guess is thematically relevant, but still a bit strange. Of course, if you're scared. What are we doing here? Don't do it. I mean. Oh, we just, we just blast it. I guess that makes sense. We got a sudden... Oh, wait. This was a terrible idea. It was. We suddenly have a, a drastically different These vibe going on. Don't know what they're in for. Hmm? That's, that's suspicious. They... What? What you doing there, Hollis? What you doing? What's your thing? If I let them go to that casino, that's it. They'd be dead. I'll just have to get Sasha to give up half of his laboratory budget. It was hard enough getting him to give up wearing socks with sandals, but you did it, Forsyth. Remember that. I don't want her to know I'm here. Need to cut out the frills in the cafeteria for sure. Yeah, what am I meant to be doing? Idea. I'm going back. No more yeah, I'll do that. <laughs> this isn't where I left. Rot row scoop. Lady of Restraint Neurological Hospital. I think Hollis said she was an intern here once. I always had my best ideas here. Let's just hope I don't run into Dr. Putz. Yeah, let's hope we don't Maybe run into Dr. To Putz. Mind is a bad idea. Whoever the fuck that is. Oh, hello there. Hmm. No, wait. I think that is a bad idea. Can I just blast the shit out of it? I can. Cool. Problem solved, I guess. Oh, hello there. Oh, so I can grab the bombs and throw them back. That's neat. Finally an actual, like, useful use for telekinesis in this game. Kind of wish I'd left him alive so I could use his bombs against these guys, but... It's very yes. cool how they've... Hang on, I should have... here for any bad ideas but my own. Speaking of, I gotta catch up to Hollis and try to change her mind about the mission. Uh-huh. Anyway, as I was saying, I think it's uh, very cool that they've added a lot more enemy types in this game. There's a, a variation and you need a bunch of different abilities to, to take them all down. Big fan of that. There's, there's one that major sound? complaint with the first one. It's that it was very homogenous when it comes to, came to the combat. I mean, the boss fights were usually pretty cool, but the, the regular fights were, were, were just a lot of those... Uh, shit, what are they called? The little business suit dudes. You know the fellas. The ones who show up and turn people out of people's brains. You know, they, they seem to be fair enough, really. That's kind of something you you want to happen. That's a that's big. There's a big figment right there. It's mine now. I feel like it should have been worth more because of the sheer size of the lad, but I guess I guess not. Oh, look what we have up here. I don't know if I could have just gone in through the front door, but I hear some emotional baggage nearby. Yeah, me too. It's right there. It was real hard to find that, but I, I sniffed it out with my keen, keen eyes. Yes, I sniffed with my eyes. That's that's a power only I have. Don't ask how I got it. Trade secrets, you know. Oh, hello there. Ah, here's the hat box tag. I want... Never mind the hatbox tag, I want that. There we go. I got what I came for. Nothing else up here? Camera seems really oversensitive again. I can't I can't find a comfortable position for it. I'm just going to have to live with it. I'm just going to have to be 
a super like immediate turn as soon as I tap my control stick. <laughs> Hooray, I did a thing. Look at me go. You do get something for doing all of those, I can't remember what it is. Maybe if I'm good at the game it will all become clear in time. Hey look over there. Look what I completely missed a second ago. I can see it. Sparkling in the bushes. A nugget. I love a nugget me. The honey crunching good. I think I hear so. Oh my god, look at the size of that kid's head! Get him to radiology, stat. <laughs> Fair. He's a bit of a stewy griffin. Uh-huh. Oh, I'm down there. <laughs> I had no clue where. I thought this was like a loading screen or something, or it was like first person, possibly. I didn't realize I was this little figure in the bottom left. This is a this is a plot twist. You saved another life, Doctor Potts. Oh, please! I was just doing my job. Oh, thank you. I heard the technique you used was developed by your intern, Hollis Forsyth. Oh, uh, my intern? <laughs> yes, yes. Well, we did collaborate on that a little. Oh. She didn't get the respect she deserved. Recovery, Dr. Potts. All thanks to you. Mm hmm And your brilliant intern, Hollis Forsythe. Why, uh, yes. Well, she has been a helpful assistant. Who? Oh. I like the look of these. This I don't. has made amazing progress. Another life saved by the Forsythe method. The, the Potts method? Potts. It was my invention. That in turn merely transcribed my dictation. Oh, uh, my apologies, Dr. Potts. In fact, I was thinking of getting rid of her. Interesting. To be fair, it sounds like everyone aside from Dr. Potts knew that Forsyth did all the work, so like... <laughs> I don't know, it doesn't seem like it could have harmed her that much, particularly. It's not like her, her research or whatever was being covered up particularly well. I got half a mind. This little guy has lost his mind, half of it anyway. You can reunite him with the other half, you'll gain a whole brain of mental energy. I've got half a mind to look for the other half. Okay. Something tells me it's not too far away. You think? I don't see it. I do see death linked with disgust. Can I make her stop hating death? I can't believe some people prefer open casket funerals. Disgusting. I can't believe some people want this. prefer open casket Thank funerals. You. Disgusting. Can link it to victory. Ah, good luck collecting your debts after I'm dead, losers. <laughs> Fair. And look what's up here. Hello there. Well, I didn't like that. They smushed their faces together. It was a bit uncomfortably sexual. As a pure Christian boy, I'm not a big fan of that. I like how I have permanently linked the concept of death with victory in, in my teacher's brain. I'm sure that will have no negative knock-on effects at any point. <laughs> So you come back here and get smashed. No good. Maybe if I move some funds around, I could postpone paying those bills. But not these. Doctor Potts is the pits. There was a doctor in a lab, and she did a thing and gave it to her superior, and he stole it and got published, and she got mad. And oh, hang on, changing minds through mental connection. Ah, so she like. <sighs> Probably fuck some people up. Because sure. this is Psychonauts then and everyone has a dark past. Like I went to school for medicine. How did I end up stressing about money management all day? Well, I just need to put those thoughts aside and focus on the children. Their safety is the most important thing. And it's not just because a lawsuit would bankrupt us right now. That casino mission would be good experience for them, but it's too risky. What if I let them go and the worst happens? <sighs> Need to focus. 
Only one unfathomable fear at a time, Forsyth. If Hollis associated risk with something more positive than death, it would open her up to so many more missions. How I is mean, she not hearing you talk? Life experiences. Ah, risk could mean money. Hmm. <laughs> Give me your wisdom, Nugget. I could make her a compulsive gambler. <laughs> Wouldn't that be cool? Oh, or I could link risk with mushrooms and make her a compulsive mushroomer. Uh, is there anything else to be collected in this here strange polygonal void? No? Okay, cool. Um, I mean, it really wants me to link money up with, with risk, but what if I just like link delight up with risk? No, to link delight with risk. Undertake risks, but what use is it? Why does there need to be a use? Yeah, you, uh, you start thinking cilantro means death. Can we do that? No, I think there's, there's only certain links we can make here based on range. We can go to risk, and that's basically it. So, uh, so much for that. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If Hollis wants to solve her money problems, she's gonna need to accept some risk. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. Interesting. So I can actually link through these middle nodes. Still can't seem to reach disgust, though. Okay. So... We go to like here and then here. Can we reach money? No. We can reach socks, socks with sandals. That could be fun. Who wears socks with sandals? Worry about rattlesnake bites? Hmm. That's not the change I was going for. It's a good change, though. Who wears socks with sandals? Worry about rattlesnake bites? Is there anywhere I can get to? I mean, I can go to delight. Undertake risks. But what use is it? Interesting. But that's not going to help us go on that casino mission. I just got the strangest urge <laughs> to go outside and kill some ants. Must be from hanging out with these kids. That's a pretty normal urge. You'll be murderous. It's fun. I don't know how I'm meant to link this to, to money, though. Am I being am I being dumb here? Oh, hang on. Hold up. You can do a, a big, big path. Did it. I did it. I solved the problem. I think I just figured out how to solve all our money problems. By taking a risk. How else? Oh. Overloaded a brain. Oh, what the fuck? Why is there a giant evil squid in the brain? That's not where giant evil squids go. They go in the ocean. Hey, Teach. What gives? I was in the middle of a sweet hookup there. Guess what, kids? You all did so well on your lesson. Yay. How about we give your new power a test drive out in the field? You mean we're going on the mission? For real? Isn't that dangerous? You know what they say, Sam. Nothing ventured, nothing brained. I don't think that's what... Let's roll. Heck yes. Cool. All right. Sweet. Um... Oh, and just like that, we're on the mission. I'm so that didn't take long. I'm so glad you changed your mind about the mission, Agent Forsythe. 
I was nervous about bringing the children, but if you feel that it's safe, then it must be. It's it must be. To find out what these delusionists are up to at the casino. With you handling tactical command, I'd say our probability of mission success has risen 35%. I'll take those odds. Now, how long till we reach the Lady Lactopus? We are almost there. Agent Foresight, how are you feeling? <laughs> Lucky. Well, we're here. I don't like how intently she was staring at the child. Using a false identity, we've secured a high roller suite to use as our base of operations. Now, children, you are not to leave the suite. Like most casinos, the Lady Lactopus has a strict no psychics policy. Aww. Weak. Be happy for this chance to observe Agent Forsyth in action. Teacup, this is Shoehorn. We are nearing position one. I'm moving down the primary ventilation shaft, and Dustpan is approaching the front desk. Teacup, come in. Are you there? Mollus. Hmm? Oh, yes. Shoehorn, this is Teacup. I have you on visual. Teacup, this is Dustpan. I'm approaching position one. After you've disabled the side detectors and inhibitors, on your go-ahead, I'll approach the reception desk and distract the clerks. After they're distracted, I'll drop into the office and find the room number that belongs to this key. Just make sure to disable the main fan, because my position is close. No need to explain, agents. You do your job, and I'll do mine. Let's keep radio silent so I can concentrate. Understood. Roger that, teacup. Dustman out. Are you gonna do anything? I'm just gonna sort of stand there. Is the power out? Not a great plan, is it? Watch this. I'll I'll go solve all the problems. I'm very talented. Well, look at that. Very pretty. <gasps> There's a toilet. Why are you? Why are you in the shower fully clothed? What are you doing in there, Sam? When Agent Forsyth finally blows, this will be the only safe place. That's a fucking massive shower, like. <laughs> Look at the size of that thing. That's nuts. Um, and you're in the bathtub, Everything's huh? Everything's good on the mission so far. You mean except for our mission commander having a total breakdown? It's not a breakdown. She's just strategizing. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I don't think you're in any position to talk about other people having a breakdown when you're stood in a bathtub. That's not normal human behavior. Oh, can we have drinks? You sure you should be making drinks? Agent Forsyth is right over there. Rasputin, we're just fooling around. Lighten up. Actually, I did eat one of those pickled onions, and I think I got a little buzz off of it. Yeah, those boys are pretty ripe. Oh. Or, you could try some actual alcohol. No? No? Not okay? Uh, maybe we should keep out of Agent Forsyth's, uh, operations... theater? Something is really not right with Hollis. What did you do to her? What? Me? Nothing. I just... Made her love gambling? She's fine. She just needs a little space. I cannot take my eyes off this train wreck. You are going to be in so much trouble. Trouble's my middle name, baby. <gasps> Rasputin, don't sneak up on me like that. Listen, do me a favor and run up to the jet, will you? I need my dowsing goggles. I left them on my seat, I think. You wanted to be on a mission. Now here's your first objective. Fetch my dowsing goggles. Okay, but hurry. Our window of opportunity is closing. All right, I'll be right back. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I'll go get caught up in some some wacky side quest while she goes gambling. All sounds all sounds good to me. Dousing goggles anywhere. I mean, to be fair, I have no idea what they look like. Probably like goggles, to be fair. Never even heard of dowsing. Oh no, Agent Forsyth, where are you going? Why did she need to send me away? Particularly, there's like six other kids in that room. Oh, no, Hollis, what did I do to you? Rasputin, is that you? Mia, Sasha, Agent Forsyth is missing. 
But don't worry. I'll find her. Hurry, Rasputin. We're in big trouble here. Yes. Please find Agent Forsyth right away. I don't know how long I can... Hold on. Oh. I'm on it. All right. I mean, how hard can it be, really? How far Lord could she have got? I can't go into the hotel. They have anti-psychic detectors. Mm. Alice must have some way to hide it. What if I just do, though? What if I just do go into the hotel? Hi. Um. Please put your brain on the ground. Alert. Uh, uh. Psychic activity detected. Weak. I mean, <laughs> that's one solution, right? Just blow the fuckers up. Can't stop me now. Can you? Okay, maybe you can, because I don't know how to work an elevator. Maybe that was my downfall the whole time. Hello. Maybe I can catch up to her this way. Uh. <laughs> okay, well, that didn't quite go as I planned it, but... The, uh, the gumption was there. Oh, it, it told me that time how to how to drop from a thingy, and I did. I did drop from a thingy. Uh, I don't like the sexy squid. A little bit turned on. A bit much for me this time in the evening. I'm going to make. Hollis, wait. No, oh, he just straight up leapt up, leapt off a building, huh? It's a nimble motherfucker. To be fair, he did grow up as an acrobat. It kind of makes sense. Mesdames et Messieurs. Ladies and gentlemen, that's your best. Don't worry, Agent Forsyth. I can fix this. Why can't I do that in game? Mesdames et Messieurs, rien ne va plus. Ladies and gentlemen, no more bets. I want the ability to turn into a ghost. I want to be a spooky boy. When am I going to learn that? Huh. Well, it's different. Yeah, it's not that much different. Same polygons, same colouring. What more do we need? Okay, some things are a bit floatier. Yeah, it's fine. We can leave. <laughs> oh, there is, there is an exit up there. Don't think I can reach it. Don't think I'm powerful enough. But theoretically, there is an exit up there. Uh, this way, I guess. Brain figments. Gotta catch them all. I'm not sure... what the actual goal is here. I mean, obviously we're going to try and fix Hollis's brain or whatever, but the, the more immediate goal, where, where exactly I'm meant to be heading? I guess I'll just go to places I've not been yet, collect things, see if I, I stumble into a, a final destination of some sort. Another half a brain over here. Pretty soon I'll have more brain than Hannibal Lecter. He, he, he ate he ate brain that was a good joke right come on at least give me a pity laugh oh shit there's another one I continue moistly slapping them together and trying not to get too grossed out by the sound hey there's risk I found it number 11 of 106. I get the feeling I'm not particularly close to the end of this area. <laughs> just this, this vague uh, idea I've had. Is that a figment or is that just like a neon sign? Just a neon sign isn't it? Yeah. I think that's everything in that room. 
moving right along. Is there nothing here we can link risk to? Agent Foresight? You in here? Oh, I don't like this one bit. There. You don't need someone to drive the car. See? Everything's fine. Oh no! Looks like Hollis had a spontaneous change in her worldview. Unrelated to my inappropriate meddling with her thoughts. Who am I kidding? I need to find Hollis's quiet room again and break that bad mental connection I made. Uh... Uh, yeah, mind stepping aside, buddy? This is an emergency. No. Okay. No. Alright. Can I just... Don't yeah, I can. Like a general no to I can just shoot the shit out of him, turns out. Oh, hi there. Can I, uh, can I have a bomb? Thank you. Beautiful. One more. Now, can I have that bomb? There we go. Easy peasy. Let's not just acknowledge the fact that I've, uh, I've lost three out of my five health majiggers. Health brains. You know, a health brain. Those things that everyone has. Uh, bombs, please. Why would I bother like fighting things normally when I can when I can throw bombs around? It's a much more exciting means of combat. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh shit, I died. Oh shit. Okay, maybe I have to take this a bit more seriously. Maybe this is the Dark Souls of Psychonauts, right? Come on, it's not one of my videos without a mention of Dark Souls at some point. Oh, that's not how I skip. That's how I skip. No, you don't mind, or like a general no to me existing. Does it? Ah, that's the that's the dodge button. Okay, I'll remember that. I definitely won't remember that, but I'll try. And you can't ask for more than that from me, really, can you? Yeah, it seems like you actually have to have to worry about avoiding attacks a bit more in this one. Combat was very much an afterthought in, in the first game, but in this one there's uh, a bit more to it, it seems. Hooray! Give me a bomb. Thank you. Love that mechanic. Big fan of that mechanic. Oh, I can lift those off. Leave me alone. Stop bullying me. I'm a good guy. I don't deserve this sort of treatment. Whoops. Killed my bomb supply. I have to fight these remaining ones the old-fashioned way, it seems. Nice projectile nerd. You did it. You got me real good. Keep trying. Good thing we're near a hospital, so uh your ghosts don't have to walk very oh never mind. Wait. I feel like he, he had a very easy joke lined up there, but he, he gave up on it far too quickly. He's a lot like me in many aspects. I relate a lot to Raz. If like, if I was like young and athletic and had magical psychic abilities, I'd, I'd basically be Raz, really, when you think about it. So many similarities to be drawn. So is, is this going to be a hospital inside, or is it going to be a casino? Is it going to be a combination of both? Who could say? Uh, 
I'm certainly never going to find out. I'm just going to hang around outside collecting shit for god knows how long. Because that's the joy of this game. It is, as the kids call them, a collectathon. I don't know, that does, it does seem like a, a relatively recent term, the word collectathon. I don't remember calling like Banjo Kazooie and Spyro and shit collectathons back in the 90s, but maybe it's just because I was too young to really know such terminology. I don't know. Just used to call them platformers, you know. I think we're done out here. I'm loving this fucking, uh, this like jazz improv sort of swing shit that's going on. This, 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 this score. It's very cool. Okay. I feel live, damn you, live. Yay. Dr. Potts. Call me Jack. Let's go for double or nothing. Woo! I don't know why I came up here, aside from the fact that I could. Now, I like this whole sort of immediately redoing um, a, an area I just did, but everything's changed sort of thing. I always enjoy that in games. Like, that's why I'm a big fan of Metroidvanias, or at least the good ones that like to twist things up and don't just have you retreading old ground all the time. Um... I think it would have been better if we'd had a slight pause between the two and don't just immediately do the two zones straight after each other because it gets a bit samey, but it's cool revisiting and just being like, hey, look how things have changed. Should we fold? No, Marinage, hold the eight and the queen and we'll pull for the inside straight. I did it. I stayed with the eight and the queen and look where it got me. Look what happened. So was Dr. Potts a gambler, or is that just like a, a, a strange combination of memories now or something? Who cares? We found what we're looking for. Hop into Hollis's quiet place and fix this mess. High Rollers Lounge? That's not good. Nothing wrong with rolling high. That's where the crits are in D&D. Oh no! Rasputin, what are you doing here? Sorry, I didn't mean to crash your hospital casino. Oh, everyone's welcome in the casino. Without gamblers, how else would we make any money? <laughs> <laughs> no, you just can't be up here because it's the High Rollers Lounge. Wait, Agent Foresight, I need to tell you. Oh, I could have kicked that guy's ass. You didn't have to be like this. Have you done that weird gravity thing? What the? Oh. oh phew. It's just the morgue. I'm sure nothing spooky will happen here in the morgue. Huh? Yes, Rasputin. Uh, we got a patient here. Needs emergency access. Sorry, the table minimum in the High Rollers Lounge is, uh, three gazillion dollars. What? How much is a gazillion? More than you got, kid. <laughs> I think she just doesn't like me very much. Uh, my patient is dying. He needs fancy drinks. Stat. In my opinion, your patient needs an emergency dose of three gazillion dollars. <laughs> is this something? Oh, this is something. Interesting. I guess there's a, an area on each side of the cube. This is going to be interesting. Anytime gravity shifts like that, I'm immediately re reminded of that one level from Sonic Adventure 2 that plays like shit. You know the one. Uh, yeah, yeah she hacked his brain. Race, ethics, guilt. Oh. Hmm. And then he came and fixed them, but then he hired her. Okay. So yeah, it sounds like she, uh... She, uh... Gave him the serious white guilt. <laughs> 
I mean, he deserved guilt for the shit he was doing, but like she um, amped it up to 11 and uh, Yeah, he went a bit nuts, and then the 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 man L Lily Lily is her name, Lily is her name Truman, I believe is his name. Um, L L Lily's dad Truman. We're going with that. Came and fixed everything and recruited her. Cool, cool story. Good to know. And now she's like the the co leader or something. So she shot up the ranks. I don't really know where I'm going. It seems to just be a big loop. Did I miss something? Did I miss something in this area? Was I not meant to have come into this area yet? Can I grab... That? Doesn't seem like it. I almost forgot about my rolly ball. I made it green and everything. How could I forget it? I guess there's... I guess there's nothing in here. I guess we just came for the... came for the vault, probably. Let's see what's on the other sides. We have maternity ward, we have the pharmacy, we have the cardiology department, and we have... wait, that's still the high rollers. What's on the other side then? Records. Okay. Let's go cardiology. I'm, f I'm feeling cardiology right now. No? Ah, wrong one. Is this what cardiology looks like? Oh no, there is something at the end. I thought it was just a tunnel. And it's diamonds! Diamonds for the win! She a specimen jar. Dang it, not again! I never thought I'd meet a talking specimen jar, but I'm not a fan. Uh, losing by following my foolish heart. What are you thinking? Hearts is like a gazillion to one. A gazillion to one, you say? So if I bid on hearts and one, I'd win a gazillion dollars. Right? Hey, where'd you go? Suddenly everything's falling into place. That's the last bet. I'm actually going to get a gazillion dollars. I like all these, like, uh, card suit people. The heads are very neat. Yep. Billy the clock got spade in full seems to be fading. There's still more things to have. Diamond Days drop spade in full seems to be fading. Let me up here. Can't go up here. Can't go into the stalls where the people watch gambling, I guess. I don't know what that place is for. Spade in full out in spade in full seems to be fading. Why is the fucking uh Dude from Grim Fandango here. What's his name? I don't know, it's been a while since I last played that game. I was never very good at it, I'm, I just kind of suck at point and click adventures. Um, ooh. What's in here? There's a narrow slot. I don't think I can One day I'll work out what I do with all these weird narrow slots. It will all become clear to me in time. Just not this time. Hello up there. Thought I missed you, didn't you? I don't know why I keep telekinesising things when I when I try and cast levitate. I keep picking things up accidentally, and I swear to god I'm not even pressing the right hand side of my controller at all. Oh, I can get up here. I didn't think I could. It seemed like I was being invisible walled for a second, but it's a little bit finicky up here for some reason. I don't know why. No, give me it. Give me it. Thank you. Cool. Nothing else? Nothing else. I'm collecting the fuck out of these things. My chances of 100% in this game are very slim. I never, I never did uh, the other one, Psychonauts One. Some people call it. I tried. I really did try, but it's so easy to miss stuff in that game. Uh, was this where I came in from? Yeah, it was. 
Obviously I missed something in there, because I was meant to come out with a gazillion dollars. It really, you, you can see the hand spawning in that little cross in, on the left. On, on the left, on the right, that's the direction I meant to say. Whenever I cast Levitate, and I really don't know why that's happening. It's like my left trigger is actually left trigger and right trigger at the same time. Whereas right trigger is also melee. Hmm. I don't know what's going on with my control mappings. I'll have to have a look at some point. I'm not going to do it right now, though. So what do I do? How do I... How do I make money? There's a hatbox over here that I just didn't clock at all. Have we got the thing for this? I'll just skip this. I think we've seen that animation enough now. Uh, does anyone want to wanna like gamble with me or something? Anyone? You? Coming up to you? The finish you? Like to make a bet. Sure. Which runner suits you this evening? I'm going to follow my heart. I got to follow my heart. What? Haven't you seen the odds? Hey, no one can lose forever, right? <laughs> you don't know hearts. And they're off. Coming up to the finish line. And it's Diamond Days for the win. That's weird. Most people usually win every time. Well, try again. Bye. Okay, that's the last bet. Runners, to your starting gates. Prepare the patient for the... They're off. I'd like to make a bet. Sure. Which hmm. runner suits you this evening? I can just keep betting, but presumably hearts will never win. Let's try clubs. I'd like to join the winners. Club. Good luck with that. Finish line, and it's spade in full, taking the trophy. Hmm. That's weird. Most people usually win every time. Well, try again. Bye. Okay, that's the last bet. Runners, to your. Is there anyone else I can talk to? Is there any the other? For the exam. Is there any other options available to me right now? I don't. I don't feel like I'm. I mean, we've not been this way, to be fair. Huh. Interesting. Hello, Mr. Hart. What's your problem, dude? Hey, are you sure you should be racing? My doctor told me I have to stay off this lane. Oh, cool camera angle. But he's also <laughs> my boss, and he told me that if I miss another race, That's beautiful. I'll get fired. What if I raced for you? What if I raced for you? What? Y you do that for me? Yes, but I can't race looking like this. Well, there's a changing room up there. What am I saying? That's impossible. This is just something I need to do. Change. Change impossible? To possible? Is that, is that, is that what they're trying to get at here? Let me just finish collecting shit in this room before I go launching myself through a TV screen. You never know when you might be able to come back through the TV screen, you know? If you're just stuck in the TV world forever. It's not a prospect I particularly relish. There's some pretty shit TV these days. I say these days as if there hasn't always been some pretty shit TV. Okay, so change is impossible. That's probably not what we want now that I think about it. Hmm. Oh, different race, same runner. I can do this on my own. I don't need anybody's help. I can't need anybody's help. Unless I link help and winning. Because I ask for help all the time. Yeah, and you suck, Raz, so what does that say? Yeah, you think I couldn't do this jumping puzzle? You're wrong. I solved that one lickety split. 
Do we know what lickety split means? And I've never really wanted to ask. It's a worrying term. People shouldn't talk about licking anything, as far as I'm concerned. Where to from hither? Yon? Yon looks good. Oh, hello there. You're very small. Why are there tiny men? Tiny, easily destroyed men. Oh. A bigger man. Can I get up there? I can. Cool. A little bit worried that that was completely outside my my capabilities as a meager baby boy, but turns out I'm more talented than I look. Oh shit, didn't realise I had to jump over these. Didn't think they were like solid obstacles. Oh fuck, um, that way? That, that way? That way looks good. So now I just link. Then again, life is more of a relay race than a wind sprint. Sometimes you need to know when it's time to pass the baton. All I have to do now is place a bet on hearts, and then take hearts' place in the race. Sounds easy enough, right? Maybe it's a thing around here. Can I take your place in the race? Let me run this race for you. You're still willing to do that for me? Of course. I'm very cool. Yes. You rest that leg. Oh my gosh, you're a lifesaver. Then fix your camera angle. I got the disguise. I'll put it on after I go place the winning bet. Isn't that a conflict of interest? No. As long as I don't tell you who I'm betting on. Oh, I see. That makes sense. See, a much smarter thing would be to replace one of the other runners. And then, while you're running as them, take out the other two. So that Hearts wins. To your starting gates. Prepare the patient for the exam. But Raz isn't that cool. They're off. I'd like to make a bet. Sure. Which runner suits you this evening? I still don't like your specimen jar head. I don't like how you have eyeballs floating in piss. It's it's not great. My heart. You never learn, do you? I never will. For sure. Okay, that's the last bet. Oh, compelling compelling disguise. I'm actually fooled by that. Heart's content is moving up somehow. Look at me go. Can I? No, I can't yep. levitate. I thought maybe I could. I think I can do this just with a bit of good old-fashioned uh, holding right there. Look at me go. I'm assuming the, the green bits are bad. I don't want to be touching those. They seem suspiciously. Whoa, fuck! That was that was that was a fast moment that I wasn't prepared for. Fuck. What? No, I still won. What are you talking about? In first place. I don't believe this. A gazillion and one miracle, and you all got to see it. Even if you didn't Ooh. win, you have to admit we're all winners here today. <gasps> Not me. Oh, you're done. No more races today. Sorry, we're broke after that race, which reminds me. Don't forget to tip your nurses, you cheapskates. Ugh. Not sure I want that. Okay, I got a gazillion dollars. One lucky card does not make three of a kind, sir. Guess I need to find two more. And I'll do that next time, because the game just auto-saved and this seems like a good opportunity to stop playing. I'll see you for that.